Good evening, I'm Jennifer Griswold. Imagine showing up to your new dream home just built and it's missing a dishwasher or tile. An area thief got away with those items and many tools from new homes in southwest Omaha. Douglas and Sarpy County authorities are working together. Senior reporter Jake Wazikowski explains what investigators are doing to get the stuff back to their owners. Sarby County authorities unload hundreds of stolen items taken from a storage unit and the home of Brett Nelson. They're worth tens of thousands of dollars. What else we got here? Uh, portable air conditioners, more shop vacs, lighting equipment. All kinds of construction tools and things supposed to be installed in homes under construction in southwest Omaha. Sarby investigators say they noticed a large number of construction site thefts and tracked the suspect down because he was pawning the equipment. The amount of property that's been taken from hardworking people that really is preventing them from doing their jobs, it's delaying the homes being uh, completed where those, uh, you know, the new homeowners are wanting to get in their houses. I mean, it's, it's affecting them as well. The 38 year old Nelson is arrested and currently at the Sarpy County Jail for eight counts of felony burglary. Don Ziesel has been a masonry contractor for 40 years. He says in the last five months, he's had his stuff stolen twice, almost a third time. I'm disgusted. I mean, we're out here, like I said earlier, trying to earn a living and they're taking your livelihood away from you. And uh, I just get really upset. Don isn't sure if any of his tools were seized, but authorities are trying to identify whose property it is. And just like with electronics, investigators say it's important to write down serial numbers of your tools so you can easily identify what's yours. Many of the items don't have identifying marks or could have been in Nelson's hands for months. They want contractors to get in touch if they've had anything stolen recently. So we're hoping contractors out there will, will, will watch and, and make contact with us. Reporting in Sarpy County, Jake Wazikowski, 3 News Now. We have a Facebook Live video posted on our Facebook page that shows all the items seized. If you recognize anything that could be yours, call the Sarpy County Sheriff's Office at 402-593-2304.